So this is Do Your Gin. And that's a wonderful box. Packed with a variety of botanicals and the equipment that will allow you to make your own gin at home. Our botanicals. There's such a variety. Look how cute they are. Different colors and textures. That's my favorite. So we have juniper, red peppercorns, lavender, coriander seeds. Very fragrant. Many of these will, will have healing properties too. We also have these two bottles for your future gins. And the funnel. So this kit includes the card with instructions that we will follow today to make um, our own gin. And the, out of the three recipes here on the card, I'm going to choose the traditional recipe. So now we're going to open our bottle and use the funnel so we can put our botanicals that we chose for this recipe into the bottle to infuse our gin. Two pots of juniper berries, then just the two little ones into the funnel. In it goes. Half a teaspoon. In it goes. So now we're going to put our alcohol into the bottle. All the way up to the top. Look at this, the diversity of ingredients in the bottle. They're already looking beautiful. Let's shake them up. So now 24 hours gone by and the gin is ready. We're going to strain it and put it into a new bottle. Using the strainer. Feel the smell, it's so fragrant. You can smell all the berries. Yum! There we go. Smells good. So, now for all those martini lovers out there, we're going to make our own martini using our own homemade gin. So, we're going to put the ice in first. Add two and a half parts of our gin. Half an ounce of vermouth. It smells delicious. And now we're going to pour it into the glass. Cheers. Do your gin.